Please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering concepts. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So in my previous video, I was explaining some of the commands which are related to editing as well as your respected drawing commands. So which is related to units, limits, dimensions, line, rectangle, circle, arc, polyline, polygon, copy. So in this video, I will explain you some of more commands which are related to text command, hatch command, uh, fillet command, chamfer command, trim command, extend command, erase command, undo command. Okay. So initially go to your respected AutoCAD software. Let us consider the rectangle REC enter. Select the starting point here. I'll, again, we have to select the ending point. So initially we need to measure the distance in horizontal position and vertical position. So go to measure the linear, select the starting point, select the ending point here. So which is comes under your respected value of five feet, uh, sorry, six feet, six inches. So in the same process, we have to measure the vertical section also. So which is comes under your respected value of four feet, 4.6 inches. So if you want to give the name for this respected rectangle, initially we need to click on the text command T enter. So after that, we have to select the starting point of the text. Again, we have to select the ending point of the text. So let us consider the text of this respected uh, rectangle name. So let us take it as REC rectangle. Let us consider. So which is consisting of your uh, approximately 6 feet 6 inches in length direction distance. Click on, click on X option. So 4 feet uh, 5 inches in vertical direction distance. So in the same process, you can select this respected text and you can give this uh, text to your respected value of 1 feet 0 inches. Let us consider, select this respected point. Okay. Now you can see the REC which is consisting of your respected rectangle having the dimensions is 6 feet 6 inches cross 4 feet 5 inches is given for this rectangular section. Okay. Now I will explain you one more command which is related to the hatch. Okay. Hatching is very much important in civil engineering for giving the material properties. So in this video, I will explain you some examples which is related to the hatch. So let us take rectangle REC. So here I am taking some uh, object which is related to the rectangular command. Again, I am taking one more object here. REC enter. Select the starting point. Select the ending point. Okay. So if you want to indicate any one of the material which is related to the concrete material or sand material, big work material for your respected object, basically we will go with hatch command. So in hatch command, it is possible to uh, notate that respected uh, block or uh, object with the help of the color also. Okay. So let us consider the hatch command shortcut is H enter. So it will ask you to select your respected internal point. So before picking any internal point, initially we need to select the patterns which is related to your respected concrete or brickwork or your respected 45 degree line depends upon your interest. So let us consider just I am taking AR concrete. So you can select the color as per your uh, respected choice. So here I am selecting the color is let us take it as blue. Okay. So here I am selecting this respected position. Again, I am changing the scale here. Let us take it as 5. Let us see. So this is the rectangular concrete block which is consisting of the concrete section inside this respected position. So here I am taking one more section which is related to the uh, color. So this is a rectangular block. In the same process, you can give the brickwork for this respected object. So H enter. So select the respected brickwork from this respected patterns. So here I am selecting, uh, let us consider uh, some these respected lines. Select these points. Okay. So now you can change the scale. So now you can see let us consider this pattern will be applied by using hatch command. Okay. In the same process, you can apply the color also for this respected object. So for that, initially we need to click on H enter option. Select this respected uh, option which is related to the uh, solid color. So let us consider just I am taking it as red color. Let us take. So click on this respected internal point. It will assign with respect to red color here. So in the same process, you can apply another 45 degree line, uh, line also. So for that, click on H enter option. Select this respected 45 degree line. So here I am taking this respected value is 15. Click on enter. Select the color as per your format. So let us consider this respected color. Click on this point. So now we can see 45 degree is assigned for this respected pattern here like this. So in the same process, we can apply the materials by using hatch command. Okay. So this is the process of applying hatch. So the next command is fillet command. So basically the fillet command and chamfer command are similar. If you want to draw any one of the curve portion, basically we will follow the fillet command. Otherwise, you can follow it as chamfer. So let us consider. So here I am taking uh, deleting all the objects which is related to the hatching of the project here like this. Let us consider. So here I am applying fillet command F enter. Select this respected object. Okay. Before selecting any one of the object, initially we need to select the uh, type which is related to undo polyline radius. So basically we will follow with radius only. So that's why just I am selecting radius. Let us take it as 3 feet 0 inches. Click on enter. Now it will ask you to select your first line. 
select the first line again it will ask you to select the second line in the same process now you can see the fillet is applied here so now i will apply a uh, chamfer for this respected portion c h a is the short form for the chamfer click on enter select the distance here so here i am selecting the distance is 2 feet 0 inches for the first line again 2 feet 0 inches for the second line so now we can see chamfer is applied for this respected perpendicular lines which is at a distance of 2 feet 0 inches in horizontal and 2 feet 0 inches in vertical now in the same process we will apply the chamfer and fillet here let us consider it as fillet command f enter so here it will select your respected radius so here i am taking the radius is 2 feet 0 inches let us consider select the two perpendicular lines which is related to the fillet command so now i will explain you chamfer cha enter select this respected distance so let us consider it as 2 feet 6 inches enter for the first line and second line also 2 feet 6 inches otherwise you can take it as another value let us take it as 3 feet uh, 6 inches for the another line now here we have to select this respected first line again we have to select the second line now you can see the chamfer is applied for this respected object here like this so in the same process you can apply the curved lines as well as your respected object here okay so this is the process of applying your respected chamfer now i will explain you trim command and extend command so these two commands are also important so let us consider the line so here i am taking drawing one line here which is related to this respected object let us consider so let us take these are my lines as an example for this respected trimming of the objects let us consider so if i want to delete any one of the object which is related to this respected uh, lines in horizontal position or vertical position basically we will follow this method so let us consider t r double enter trim option so if you want to delete any one of the object which is related to excess of the portion basically we will follow the trim command t r double enter select the line that you need to delete or trim excess of the object so trimming is nothing but the cutting of the extra portion for this respected object so now you can see the object is trimming here for this uh, requirement of your respected drawing okay now we can see the trimming of the object is applied for this respected section here like this please remember this point the trimming is only applicable of if the external line is exist for this respected continuous object okay so please remember this point this is also one of the important point for trimming of the object okay so this is the process of trimming your lines by using uh, autocad software okay so this is the process of trimming so now i will explain you extend command so basically extend command is similar to your respected trimming option in the trimming option we are removing the excess of the portion in extend command basically we will add the one more portion section so here i am selecting e x double enter extend command so here i am selecting this line now you can see the line is extending for your original position like this okay so in the same process you need to apply the extension for the horizontal position as well as your vertical position so this is the process of your extension of the line by using autocad software so this is the process you can extend the line as per your convenient as per your requirement of the drawing okay so now i will explain you next command is erase command so basically this is also one of the most important command so let us consider just i am drawing one circles and objects which is related to rectangular command c enter select this circular let us consider rec enter select this point rec enter click on enter option select this point again i am selecting circle let us consider this okay so if you want to delete this respected uh, object with the help of the erase command so basically we will follow the letter as e enter okay so basically we will select the object which is related to your deleting of your respected objects let us consider so after that we have to click on enter option so it will erase your respected objects as per your requirement okay so this is the process okay so last and final command is undo command so this is also one of the most important so for undoing the your respected object basically we will click on u enter okay now we can see all your erased objects are came to your respected drawing file okay so this is the process of your respected remaining commands which are related to uh text command hatch command fillet chamfer trim extend erase undo okay if you have any queries about this respected video please text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for that respected question thank you